Everyone knows oxygen is essential to life, but a body that can utilize that oxygen most effectively and efficiently will be able to perform much better. Imagine performing with more power or greater endurance, having less muscle fatigue and soreness. Or just imagine walking up a flight of stairs without sweating and breathing heavy. Both are completely doable. Known as Cyclic Variation and Adaptive Conditioning, CVAC for short. The CVAC process is a unique approach to improving your overall physical conditioning. While you just sit and relax in the pod, the air pressure continually changes two to 400 times in 20 minutes. These continual pressure changes challenge you to adapt and benefit you from, well, your brain to your toes. The CVAC process not only helps increase your athletic performance, but the way that it helps in your recovery can go well beyond just inflamed, tired, and sore muscles. And the end result is more energy and faster recovery. Otto is a soldier and also an avid cyclist. After hurting his hip during military exercises, which led to back issues, Otto has ended up using the CVAC pod to aid in his recovery, including getting back on his bike. This is his story. I have been with the Canadian Forces for almost 20 years now in a uh, combat trade, which is very physically demanding. What we do takes a toll on, on your body, and uh, uh, currently I'm awaiting surgery. I'm just right now on the waiting list and doing some physical conditioning in preparation for the surgery, what the experts, I guess, call prehab, which is kind of like a relatively new thing compared to rehab. A one frustrating aspect of my condition right now is that as I'm waiting, I'm not able to be as active as I normally am. And so there are very few ways in which I can try to stay fit. That's where CVAC came into play. Uh, after trying it a few times, I noticed a few things. For example, my ability to walk or even speed walk up a steep hill. Uh, that changed dramatically to the point that uh, at the top of the hill, I'm not even panting. Uh, my heart rate is uh, very steady. That, that, was, that was amazing. That was a real good day for me, yeah. It has improved my quality of life. I notice an undeniable improvement in my cardio capacity whenever I do things that require my lungs to work a little bit. It's just amazing the benefit that this technology has brought into, into my life. So while I wait for my surgery, I can benefit from this CVAC te technology so that I can not only stop the decay, but also maintain and perhaps even improve my physical conditioning so that when I am finally declared fit uh, to active service, I don't have a, a long way to catch up and when it comes to, to my fitness overall. Um, besides uh, my well-being, my pain level has changed dramatically and uh, I'm really happy about that. It's, uh, CVAC is uh, very fun to do and uh, um, I can see results right away, uh, definitely. So as we saw with Otto in the pod, he was holding up this water bottle and the level that Otto was getting up to, he was getting up to 10,500 feet. And so what he did was he opened up the water bottle at 10,500 feet, which is obviously much less pressure uh, and much less air density than at the ground level. Closed it again and so when we get down to ground level, this is what we see. So it squishes down because here at ground level there's a lot more pressure outside pushing on the water bottle here. So if I was to open it again, I'm releasing all that low pressure and we're back to a regular size water bottle and that's just the way the air pressure works. Higher, lower air pressure and the continual changes is how your body adapts and gets more energy.